Hello Stalker, so in this video I will show you some of the best combat mods that you can add to your Stalker Anomaly mod list. These combat mods will add a lot more immersion when you are firefighting or even sniping. Also, these mods are all compatible with all my other mod lists that I've shown in other videos. So let's begin by adding Dark Signal Weapon Sound Pack. This sound pack is very similar to JSRS sound pack, in fact it is based on it, but it has been improved quite a lot. When you shoot your weapons, you can actually hear reverb and echo sounds going through all the landscape. Another thing that I like about this sound mod is the amazing distance gun sounds that you can hear. In warfare mode for example, when stalkers are fighting each other, you can actually hear distance gun sound quite clearly. There is another mod that I like to use that adds a bit more immersive sounds. The Gear Rattle Sound mod will add rattling sounds to your character when you are walking, running and also jumping. If you lower your weapon or aim, you can actually hear gun rattling sounds, adding another layer of immersion to combat. Along with uh, gear rattling sounds, I also use weapon tilt cover, which allows your stalker to tilt your weapon that he is using, allowing you for more tactical combat. The animation kicks in when you are close to a surface or an object. You can also set a keybind from the MCM menu to allow you to tilt your weapon whenever you want. If you want a bit more realism with weapons then you can try the scope shader mod. The scope shader mod adds the scope effect to all scoped weapons in the game. modifies the zoom and adds new effects to the scopes, adding an immersive effect whenever you're zooming in with your weapon. With this mod, scopes will look like they have a realistic lens effect. If you want to make the AI a bit more intelligent, then you can try Mora's AI cover mod. This mod modifies the AI behavior and makes stalkers take cover in a fight. Usually stalkers will just charge after some time, but with this mod on, stalkers will be a lot more careful in combat, taking cover whenever possible. Well stalkers we are halfway through this video so make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you're new to my content. I do a lot of stalker normally and gamma guides and I love testing new bots and show them to the stalker community. One thing that bothers me in stalker normally is that enemies will pretty much see you even if you're in the bushes with a ghillie suit 
This is why I like to use the stealth mode. This mod allows you to be sneaky and enemies will not see you from miles away, especially if you're wearing a ghillie suit. The mod calculates which outfit you are wearing, how fast you are moving, how much light is on your character and also how much weight you are carrying and then modifies the spotting system of the game in real time. So if you're running it out with an exosuit, they will notice you right away. But if you're wearing a light outfit, then they will not see you right away at all. Allowing you to be sneaky in the game. This mod also adds a small gizmo that shows how much light is on you. All the settings for this mod can be changed in the MCM menu. Another great mod that you can add is the Intimidation Surrender mod. This mod will allow you to intimidate your enemies and force them to surrender. Works well with the Stealth mod. This mod works by checking the rank of your enemy and the gear that he has. And it will also check the position of your character. If your character has better gear and better rank than your foe, the mod will force the enemy stalker to surrender. Also, if you are behind the enemy and you catch them by surprise, you have a better chance to intimidate surrender. All you have to do is get close enough to the enemy and press the action button. If you want to add more immersive sounds, then check out Distant Mutant Sounds. This mod adds Distant Mutant Sounds that play when mutants are at a certain distance from your character. I like to use this mod as an early warning system to know exactly which mutants are lurking around me. It also removes all the fake mutant sounds from the game. If you like to be a team leader and you like to play with followers, then you might want to try Maki Hand Gesture system. This allows your character to play hand gestures to communicate with your companions. Each command will have your character play a unique animation accordingly. I love this mod especially when I'm leading a squad of stalkers to attack my enemy in warfare mode. It also has a special animation to show love to your enemy. Last but not least, this is the ledge grabbing mantling mod which allows your character to climb over obstacles and get to higher places. This mod is especially good if you combine it with the stealth mod, especially if you're going to play as a sniper. Also, if you're looking for a bit more roleplay in Stalker Anomaly, check out my video about classes and talents mod, which allows you to choose a class for your character. I hope you stalkers found this video useful, if you have any questions about this mod write down here below in the comments. Also I have a lot more exciting content for stalkers so make sure to subscribe and follow me on YouTube. Bye and thank you for watching.